case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Supreme Court case Ashcroft v. Al Kidd in 2011 centered around Abdullah Al Kidd's lawsuit against former Attorney General John Ashcroft for authorizing the detention of terrorism suspects without probable cause. Al Kidd, a U.S. citizen, claimed he was detained without being called as a witness, and the court had to decide if Ashcroft had qualified immunity, which shields officials from lawsuits unless they violate a clearly established constitutional right. The Fourth Amendment, which protects against unreasonable seizures, was in question. Al Kidd's complaint alleged that Ashcroft authorized federal prosecutors and law enforcement officials to detain individuals with no intention of calling them as witnesses. Despite being detained for 16 days and on supervised release for 14 months, Al Kidd never testified. The Supreme Court ruled that Ashcroft had qualified immunity, emphasizing that objectively reasonable arrests under valid warrants cannot be challenged based on improper motives. The court held that Al Kidd's arrest and detention did not violate the Fourth Amendment due to the presence of probable cause and a valid warrant. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.